Once upon a time, there lived lots of dolls. Monster High. When one day, everyone in school just disappeared. No one was ever seen. On the next day of school, then Frankie commented that where was everyone? And nobody ever knew. From the old ancestors of all of these people, because they went back in the future. How did this all happen? Let's go back 25 minutes ago. Well, this is when Goldia was asleep. She had created a secret time machine in a room of mystery. Since the last story, she had an evil twin. A giant hand of mystery hides in there. Her evil twin had a copy of everyone else in their town else in their town, in the school, into them, copies of them, and then made them pass out down in the dungeons. The time machine that they pulled out by the time of the ancients. I didn't stop during the way. So, well, the problem was, they travel back in time through the time machine and went past through the future. The hand grabbed Frankie out of the door and teleported her. When she ran up, when everyone was asleep, except for Cleo standing up sleeping, um, Gulia went in there and saw, and she got taken too. When everyone woke up, they wondered what happened, but the door was clean shut. How did this happen? They didn't know. The next night, the next night, when everyone, when Jackie Moore was asleep, one day, one time, Leo went all the way upstairs to get a drink of water, and she fell down into the stairs and got a, and got time machine too. And Frank and Jackie Lawrence was all left alone. She knew the giant hand would never eat her because he doesn't like eating vampires. How about who? But when Claudine came and said, where is everyone, Jackie Laura? I don't know. Everyone has disappeared. But there's something in here. I can hear something. I'm going to go in. No, Claudine! And then the, all the lights went out. All the lights were about to go out. All the energy was going away. On and off. On and off. On and off. Then it, all the light power was all over. She didn't know what would happen. Dungeons and dungeons of sparkles and cones. She got tears. And wondered where everyone went. They went back in time to a time when Jackie Laura didn't live in Monster High. She was lost. Because the time machine juice was left there in the middle of the floor so they couldn't come back to their own time period. And then they, then all of them fell back through the time period. Claudine first. 
Then after that, it was Jackie. Then it was Frankie. Frankie fell in. Then Gulia fell in. And then Cleo fell in. It was back when Jackie and Laura didn't even live. The hand doesn't exist yet. Uh, well, they didn't know what happened. They thought they just they just thought it was all a dream, and they thought they were in the same place. But they wondered where Jackie and Lauren was. Back all the way in the future, Jackie and Laura was waiting when they would come out. And was they stuck there forever? She found the juice. And the hand was trying to get that juice. And then she drank it, thinking it was some kind of juice. She fell to the floor. And then she started to go in the air and glowing. And then a transformation was saying from a ghost. How would you? You can choose to transform to anything. Anything? Yes. Anything. What will I do? I can't turn into myself. I can't do anything. And hand came out. Or also die. But the hand. And take the pulse. Oh no, and I exploded. Fine, I will be something different. But this won't mean, just don't hurt my friends. I won't. But this is the last chance. And all the way back, having such fun, but they noticed that they traveled more in time. They went more in the future than they even were. When Claudine wasn't alive, they lost Claudine. She had. If they don't fix this, none of the ghouls will ever live. Then they went back in the future again, and and then Frankie was alive. They had to do something. Gulia said. And Cleo said. Good idea. We can find the Time Master Gods. And it took the... Hey! That's the Time Machine. We're stuck here. We have to find the Time Machine Gods. And or else our friends will be trapped in a time period where they never existed. And we'll never have the ghoul friends we ever had. And this was the... And then you took Golia. Golia, no! And I took... Who am I saying we? They're gone. And they and then the lights went out darker. Really dark. And then she climbed upstairs. Then she saw something. She was seeing that there was a giant thing over here. Then she twisted it. And there was a thing that was half a shape. Whoa! Well, a passage and something came through. Okay, here we go. And then she fell into another part of the castle. She said, it looks the same. And then the time god came. What are you doing on my side? What are you doing on my side? The hand. And yes, the and hand. Another person, another call, and this was the, the sign. What shall I do? <laughs> My friends are lost in time. And, they, you and I can't, can't do anything take about a, it. Take a video of You cannot ever leave. Even close. This yeah. place. Why? Why? Because you're trapped here. I will. I'll kill myself for the sacrifice of my family. Ancient Egyptian. Then 
video. Everyone teleported back to their own time period. And every frame was all messed up. Then Claudine just fell in. They wondered where Cleo was. They went upstairs. Claudine went upstairs to go look for Cleo. And what she saw was a dead body of Cleo. Which it started to glow. And glow. And glow. And Cleo. Cleo transformed back to life. And she said, Nothing can ever beat the Egyptian gods. Ah! Yeah, she's alive. And I took the carpet. Stop, legend. Then we all lived in a nice monster high school, but everyone else was done with their curse. And everyone lived happily ever after. The end. And nobody's allowed to go